Hi, in this course I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a membership site in Weebly. So my name is Adam, I'm a software developer and also a Weebly user, and I'm going to use the site that I created called Automated Website Course at automatedwebsitecourse.com to show you an example of a Weebly site. This is a Weebly site, and it has tutorials for Weebly users on how to do things like uh, create Facebook ads and direct traffic to your Weebly website with Facebook. And so, for example, if you clicked on on face, the Facebook ads course, you would go to this login screen because it's a membership site. So Weebly has a lot of this functionality now baked into it where you can create members only area like with restricted access. And I will show you in this course how to make it so people have to pay to get access to that members area, making it a paid membership site. So let's say I wanted to get into this course that I don't have access to. Well, I would find a link to the course by looking in your courses. And let's see, I want the Facebook ads course, so I'd click on that. I go to something that describes the course. So Facebook ads course, get traffic to your Weebly website. I have a little video that I embedded that people can watch that introduces the course. Um, and the prerequisites are listed and course objectives. And then you just click take this course. Now you could create whatever flow you want. This is just the flow that I created. And I'm not the best designer in the world. I'm more of a software developer. So the Facebook ads course, get traffic to your website today. It's a one month membership. So your access will be removed after a month. And let's see, just click add to cart and check out. So it's a $97 course and you can see that listed over here, subtotal. So your users would just click checkout and purchase the course. I've made a coupon code to demonstrate this without having to buy the course in the video. And I'll just apply the coupon. And so now the subtotal is zero. So your user would just enter their email address and their credit card information unless it's a free course. So the user would just enter all their information, click next. And then they would click complete order. Great. So they'll get an order confirmation that they've purchased this course, and you'll get an order confirmation that they've purchased the course as well. And now, as the customer, I just received an email invitation to the area I just purchased. And if I click here, so let me create a password. And now that the password's set, I can log in. And your customer just logs in, and now I have access as the customer to the Facebook Ads course. Now you can create a lot of different areas I'll show you in this video. This happens to be an online course. You can do digital downloads. You can do an offline subscription box if you want. You can do a series of tutorial videos. Uh, but I did an online course, so I customized the theme a little bit. Here's uh, the introduction video, Welcome to Facebook Ads. There's a little video here that welcomes you to why you'd want to use Facebook ads. Then I can click next and go to the next video. Uh, and this is all just things I did with the Weebly drag and drop uh, editor. Back to the table of contents. So that is the members only area. And so then if I logged out here, go to my account and log out, and then someone comes to your website and tries to get into that course who isn't a registered user, again, they'll get to this login screen. So we just created a paid membership site out of a Weebly website. Let me show you another example of how to do this. So here's my Weebly developer test site. This is what it looks like. Uh, this is just a, took two seconds to put in this template from Weebly. Um, New York in the spring, it just comes like this. The only thing I customized is this link that says become a member. I put a link here. I also put a link here to become a member. You can use either one. So let me click become a member. And this person has a membership that's one month for $29. I'm gonna add that to a cart and then click checkout. Cool, a membership, one month, $29. And I'm gonna add a coupon code Now the coupon code is just for the video, so I don't have to purchase $29 for myself. <laughs> and now your customer can just go ahead and enter their information and they will receive an email with access to the course. So how do you set this up? Well, let me show you here. So what you're gonna wanna do is have some kind of page with some valuable content. So in Weebly, it's really easy. The content is really up to you. You have so many options. So I just threw some examples together, like a members only video. Here's a little video. This is an MP4. 
just example video. So this would be a video that you upload as an MP4. Uh, perhaps you might want to link to a YouTube video. So there's an option to just link to a YouTube video. You just put the the um, the link of the YouTube video. It's pretty easy. This is just a JFK video. Ask not what your country can do for you uh, that I embedded here. You can also do members only downloads. So let's say you have some PDF. That's like a special PDF that you wrote. You can have those downloads. You can even embed that into the site so they can view it without downloading the file. Here's an Excel file. If you had some Excel file that you created, you can do members only audio. You can play, uh, upload an audio file like that. And you might have an uh, online course like I did, and you can just list pages here, lesson one, two, three. And actually, let me show you, I didn't link this yet. So lesson one, I'm going to link it to a standard page that I created called lesson one. And let me link that. And let me publish that. And so that's going to link to another page. So for example, if you did do an online course, you'd have a number of lessons. And if users clicked on one, they'd have access to that page. And so let me show you what that page looks like, like lesson one here. Here it is. It's just a little video, members only lesson one. It's just a kind of simple video. And you set the visibility. And I set the visibility to members area one, which is a group. So let me show you how this works in Weebly. So one of the really cool things that Weebly did is it allows you to have different membership levels. So right now you can see that there are no members. I don't have any members of my site yet, so no one has access to any of these courses. And I have one group. A group is like an umbrella. And what it does is it allows you to have different membership areas. So you could have uh, like your basic users, your premium users, and your VIP users, and they could all have access to different pages. So let me click on membership area one and Let's call this, actually, let's change the name of this and call it just basic users. So our basic users will have access to what? Valuable content A in lesson one. So let me save this. So cool, now we have our basic users. If I click on there, you can see the pages this group can view is valuable content A in lesson one. And that is listed here. Here's lesson one. You can see the visibility is set to the basic users. And we can see valuable content A, and the visibility from that is also basic users. So if you're a basic user, you can access both those pages. Here's members only videos, everything I just showed you. So why don't we publish this site? And I've gone ahead and gone to the App Store and searched for paid members which is the app that I created, Paid Members app, create paid membership sites with subscriptions, and you can click on that. So you're gonna want to add this app, and I've already added it to this site. So you can see my apps, I've installed Paid Members app, create a paid membership site. So now I'm on the live site, just like a normal customer, and I'm gonna click Become a Member. And let's say I wanna become a member for a month, I click Add to Cart. And I'm going to check out. I already applied that coupon code. Quantity one. Great. So now I'm going to check out. And enter, I entered all my information. I'm clicking next and then complete order. OK, so now I've been sent an invite. And if I go to that invite, it says, you've been invited to join the Weebly developer test site. And I'm going to click there. And then I just set up a password. And now I can log in with my email address and password and access members only content. So you can see here is my account, choose a page to access. I've been given access to valuable content A and lesson one. So let me look at valuable content A. So here we go. Here's this members only video I can watch. And you've seen this on the back end already. Here's a YouTube video. Here's some downloads. Like let's say I want to download this PDF. Perfect. And let's say I want to listen to this audio, it would be here. And I also made an online course. And if I click on that lesson one, I go to members only lesson one. So there's kind of infinite possibilities of what you can embed. You're only limited to what you can put into Weebly, which is pretty much anything, audio, video, any kind of digital content. You can also be sending something offline. You might drop ship or have some like subscription box you're sending to people, or you might uh, schedule an appointment with them now. Uh, because it's uh, like you're doing some coaching or something. You can do all of this uh, using Weebly now. Now you can create a 
paid membership site in Weebly, which is a drag and drop website builder. It's the fastest and easiest way to create a paid membership site. 